Hello students, this is BS Academy Classes, presented by Sandeep. Students, in the last few lectures, I completed the data interpretation part, number system part and the also I discussed some of the important topic of research methodology and I also discussed the teaching aptitude important topics. So, to continue that particular series of research methodology, I, in this topic, I will, uh, I will discuss the what are different type of criteria uh, for the selection of research design. In the last lecture, I discussed what is the meaning of research design and, uh, and what different type of different topics available inside the research design which I will, dis I will uh, discuss thoroughly in the future, in, in the future lecture. So, uh, before I start my lecture, uh, students, so your exam is approaching and this exam is in on 5th November 2000, uh, 2017 and uh, which is, uh, which is on Sunday. So, students, uh, please uh, try to make hard and uh, because uh, uh, if you study very thoroughly and very uh, execute your plan completely, then definitely you will succeed in your this exam. And this exam is very important for all those people who want to become assistant professor or or they want to uh, uh, do JRF means the junior research fellowship or all, also for all those students who want to uh, complete their PhD and also uh, all those other students who want to uh, uh, come under the category of for some research aspect. Okay, so in this topic. I will discuss the what are the important type of criteria availability for the selection of research design. So first is the nature of the study. The students uh, for for our um, for in, in our research design or for in our, our research topics, we have different type of study. Like uh, we can select the science study and for we we have sometimes select the sociology type of study. So all these study are very different in their nature. So different type of study have some different type of research design. If suppose that I choose the uh, computer, uh, computer science, uh, some topic of computer science and I'm doing some research on this particular topic. So I will select only though, I will select only those research design which will fulfill my, my design of which will fulfill my, my desire needs. Okay. So, your nature of study and the nature and scope of study play a very important role for your selection of research design. The next important top, next important criteria is your purpose of study. What is the your need? And what is your purpose for your study? For example, if you want to, uh, if you want, if you want to uh, fi fi want to find uh, finding find out the, some important uh, measurement in your study, then your purpose will always. Uh, is your your uh, right approach to select your research design? Should, our next important criteria for the selection of data research design is your nature and place of data collection. Because uh, your data collection is very crucial for your research and also for your finding and conclusion. If you you can't interpret your research if you collect your data in a very wrong fashion or if your if you uh, collect your data unethically. So data data collection play a very important role. For example, if I am doing my research inside the laboratory, then I will select only those particular research design which will fulfill my desire and which fulfill my need. So, your nature and the data collection is play a very important role. For example, all other students uh, who uh, implement their survey or design their survey, so they will select only that type of research design which uh, they can complete their research, uh, for example, they are doing survey. So, they will select only those particular type of research design which they from their that particular research design they can complete their survey. Okay. Then, next important topic is technical tools of data collection. Now, uh, after the data collection, we will process our data and also we will represent our data in some type of other fashion so that we can easily process our data inside the software. So, your technical tools for data collection play a very important role and also there are many type of non-technical person who are, who don't have any knowledge about, of, about the software. So, they go for, the, they go for the training. So, to train those type of people, we also select that particular type of research design so that we have some scope to train that particular type of people. So, technical tools also play a very important role for our selection of research design or RD. Then, Next important criteria is for your time study. I I have seen so many people who complete their study in three uh, three months, also six months, because they these type of their nature of study is very important. is very quite different. For example, if you are doing doctorate degree, then you have some type of time time foundation in your inside your mind because they you want to complete your research in inside the in the time foundation. For example, for, for example, you are, you want to complete your research in three to four years. So you will 
choose that particular of research design in which you can complete your research you can complete your research in that particular time duration so time of study also play a very important role then next is type of sample design now what is the meaning of sample design and what kind of sample design we have generally for example if you uh, if you know in a very layman term if i i, I will uh, I will say about the sample design. Then we have some around two to three type of sample design. For for example, we have the probabilistic type of sample design and also the non-probabilistic type of sample design, or maybe some statistical tool uh, sample design. So our type of sample design also play a very important role, and also the the type of study of population. Because ultimately, suppose that we are doing research on the ten thousand people, so we will collect only that particular sample design in which we will. Uh, represent our 10,000 people inside that particular sample design. So our sample design also play a very important role in the research design, and also uh, your method of data analysis. Because ultimately, once you collect your data and once you represent your data by using the technical tools, and then you will process your data, and you also run some different type of statistical uh, test on in, uh, on our on your data. So your data should be very means what can i say produce a very good result for your study and also your findings and conclusion also match your data analysis part so data analysis part also play a very important role in your selection of criteria for the research design and next is for your resource availability no sorry resource availability the, what is the meaning of resource availability for example if i am doing any research and they uh, and the the past researcher or the past scientists have ha, did some Good uh, study on that particular type of research design uh, on uh, inside our type of topic of our uh, research topic. So I will select only that particular research design which uh, we will, uh, which uh, has some traditional knowledge of that particular research design. So your research availability also play a very important role in the selection of research de design. Then the next important uh, criteria is your researcher experience and as well as their knowledge because uh, uh, if you have some done some. Uh, good research in the past also then you know what kind of research design available in the market and also you can also design uh, design your research design on the from the from the selection of one or two type of research design hybridly so your past experience and knowledge is very important in for the selection of research design so that's why uh, you choose your uh, mentor your mentor uh, response also inside the whenever you select any type of design a research plan whenever you uh, submit your research plan then they you always go for the their experience their knowledge experience and also you go for the, your also go for your also knowledge experience then students inside our this particular part i discuss lots of about your uh, what are the different type of selection criteria available for the research design so once once again i will revise all these things your nature of a study and your need and purpose of the study also play a very important role for a selection criteria for the research design then next is your nature and place of collection of data collection because i already so told you uh, many uh, research researcher or many scientists have different type of data collection in their study they use their in, in the study so their data collection and the nature of data collection also play a very important role then technical tool availability for the data collection then time period of the study i already told you uh, some people want to complete their study in 3 months some people want to complete their study in 6 months and some pe people want to complete their study 3 to 4 years so different type of time duration have different type of research design next is your type of sample design i already told you what kind of time sample design i we have i will de definitely discuss this topic very thoroughly in the future video what is the meaning of sample design and how can we uh, Correct data using our sample design also. Then next important topic or te next important criteria is method of data analysis. Data analysis. This this topic is very technical. And then next is resource availability. What kind of literature available we have um, for our study and what kind of uh, research design we can choose from our this resource availability. Then next is our researcher experience and knowledge. Students, uh, researcher experience and knowledge play a very important role because if they have did some good experience, good knowledge of regarding their their domain, then definitely they will choose that kind of research uh, research design which will give their good result and which is very uh, uh, which which and they also want to avoid less error 
to design that particular research plan. Also, student, research design play a very important role for the creation for the your research plan also. So, all these things a very important role for the selection of research design and also uh, these uh, important topics are not only uh, very important for our selection criteria but your study point of point of view also okay so students in this lecture i discussed the what are different type of criteria for the selection of research design and and uh, students if you f still face any problem regarding this topic and also any other topic you can rightly mail give me a mail, mail id okay so students and uh, i will definitely want to uh, 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 solve your problem and as well as if you still face any problem write to write me your mail id okay so friend thank you